Good evening. Snow removal crews in Sioux Falls are gearing up to work their ninth weekend in a row with more winter storms on the way. Yeah, with tomorrow morning, rain and snow on Saturday, and then a repeat of that early next week, the streets department is facing a few challenges. The teams are ready. They're scheduled. We've got salt, sand, and chemical ready. That's because we're going to have snow, snow, and more snow. But we just haven't seen any melting, and so it just continues to stack on top of each other. It's making the snow piles so high, it's tough for drivers to see. Around the corners, slow down. Don't just go blasting through there because somebody might be going the same way. Solom has noticed all of the snow is narrowing side streets. It's like one lane. You meet somebody, you got to be polite, either let them go through or they got to be polite to let you through. Street crews are removing what they can on curbs, boulevards, and intersections to make it safer for drivers and to make room for, you guessed it, more snow. All of us are ready for a little bit warmer weather. Sioux Falls Director of Public Works, Mark Cotter, says crews are preparing in other ways for the next winter blasts. Four crews are out working on potholes and others are clearing a path. Any areas where we've had uh, issues with melting snow, ponding, that's significant. We're out cutting ice in front of those intakes today to get ready for that potential of rain that may come on Saturday. While plow drivers prepare for the weekend, Sola is trying to do the same. Oh, I'm tired of it. I'm so ready for spring. Yeah, you and me both. <laughs> Cotter says the city is also preparing for what happens when the snow melts. I asked him if there are any worries about flooding. He says the city is keeping an eye on it and recommends homeowners take a look at how the snow will melt off their roofs, in their yards, and make sure their spouts are pointed in the right directions.